Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're going to be playing Wrong World. This is a very interesting indie style game where you play this little cute... What? He just lost an eye guy. And um, it's a very funny kind of gameplay, but it is also serious at the same time because whenever you come into here to make a game, you'll see normal mode is permadeath mode and what that really means is that not only do you lose everything when you die your save is deleted and you also lose the ability to um, regenerate health whenever you're hit so you have to feed yourself cooked food things like that to be able to regenerate your health then you also get experience but you don't get experience while you're playing the game you get experience at the end of your game meaning that whenever you die you get a tally of experience based off the things that you did during your gameplay and then you get to uh, get rewards from it so this is going to be a pretty interesting game i have only read up a little bit about it and I feel it's going to be pretty great. I, I, just by the things I've seen and the pictures I've seen of the different kinds of mobs in the game. So let's get into it and uh, see what's going on. So the first thing is movement, W-A-S-D. <laughs> I must have missed the key there. And then left mouse to attack. Oh, so cute all right and then mouse to interact with like trees and things like that so let's go ahead and oh wait a minute <laughs> we're hitting we're chopping trees with our head um that is pretty awesome so i gotta wonder whatever the guy was making the game was he was was he like okay so i'm making the game with permadeath survival and we're going to need to be able to gather resources but you're not going to start with any tools we're, we're going to just go that route so how are we going to be able to pick the resources that we need for the uh the game and they're like you know what the whole minecraft thing that's that's done that's over with punching trees with your fist and everything let's find a funnier better way to do it and what do they do? They make it so that you can punch trees with your head. <laughs> this is so freaking awesome. Also, the game graphics are just really cool. And the sky, it looks like it's paint. Oh, and look at the sun. It just looks so awesome. All right. Uh, stone. Yep, we, we hit stone with our head as well. <laughs> so... I know that after looking over the key bindings and everything that you press the E button to look at your inventory and the Q button to look at your crafting and you have four different types of crafting you can do it looks like uh, build structures to unlock new crafting uh, this is structures here so campfire workbench smelter anvil cooking pot and then the rest are just not um, crafting benches, I think. I mean, this looks like it would add to the amount of food that you can make. Uh, the campfire probably is just what's required. Let's see here. Food, meat. Uh, meat is murder. Tasty, tasty murder. <laughs> and it gives you one health uh, per food. You got potatoids. Uh, potatoid fries and that is one health uh, five health for mushrooms that's awesome where we already got one mushroom and fish fingers that is uh, two f blobfish campfire so yes all of these require the campfire to be able to cook them so I'm, uh, I'm just really stoked about this game it has everything that I like survival it's a sandbox style game um, I believe, and uh, don't quote me on this, that the maps are procedurally generated, but certain things will always be in every map, that kind of thing. And I kind of want to set a goal for myself, not to do anything stupid. 
Meaning that I'm more I'm not gonna pick fights with things that I shouldn't pick fights with. I don't have any tools right now, so I shouldn't be picking fights with anything. Though I do need food. Um let's see what we have right now. We have wood. Wooden wood. Use it to build things. <laughs> Use a shovel to impregnate the ground with an acorn. Falapal. Some kind of ancient uh, alien fruit with wings for some reason. So we can eat this and it will give us hunger back. Uh, we have seeds. Shovel plus ground plus seeds equals baby vegetables. A stone and then our mushroom. So that's awesome. We, we got some of the things. Are you going to attack me? No. If I hit you, will you attack me? No. I'm going to attack you then and see if you drop anything like food because food is going to be a, a thing for us. Especially if we get damaged, we're going to have to be able to eat things and hopefully that's what these guys drop. So, yes. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of food right there. Let's go ahead and hit some more trees here. Let's see, what do some of these benches take? It's five wood and five stone for the campfire. 20 wood for the workbench. 20 uh, stone plus 20 coal for the uh, smelter. And two iron bars for the... Thought I heard something. Okay. <laughs> um, and two iron bars for the anvil. So I think what we're going to do is instead of making tools right off the bat, we're going to make the workbenches that we can with the resources that we can just pick up by harvesting. And then maybe by doing that, we'll get a chance at making better tools and then use that to be able to get better at the game or beat the game or whatever whatever the uh, the goal of the game is i mean the goal is probably just straight up survival though i think i read that you have a choice of staying on the planet or you can build your ship to get off of the planet so I'm really interested in building the ship, but I don't want to say in the game before I have explored everything about this planet. Just because I feel that would be we, we'd be at a loss if we if we didn't explore the planet completely. All right, stop running! <laughs> and these guys take a lot of hits to die too, so they're pretty beefy, like cows. <laughs> Um, okay, so uh, jump while attacking to do a combat roll or dodge uh, enemy attacks. So I got a leather. Okay, let's see. It's leathery. And we got more meat there. Okay, that's cool. Uh, well, stone. This, I was going to get this stone because it's a big stone. Let's see what we got out of it. How are we doing on wood? We have 36 wood already. That is crazy. All right, and let's start just getting stone. I know we need more wood than what we have, but let's just try to get as much stone as we can because that is where we're getting resources like this from, uh, this copper ore. Um, I want to organize. So this and this, let's say that goes together. This and this being that they're both stone products go together. These are all wood products. Let's just do it like that. I'm kind of um, annoyed because these are not in the same row like like this. So we had to make that change real quick. So yeah, I'm really, really enjoying the game. I think this is a really cool idea. He's still in the works. He's still doing things to get the game made. So any kind of suggestions that are made are always welcome, I'm guessing. So we while we're playing the game we'll decide if there's anything that we need to maybe change and i i'm not gonna be one of those people that says oh that just that texture just is weird or that sound that that thing is making is is whatever i'm not gonna do that I'm, i think that the sounds in the game are pretty cool the fact that you whenever you hit a mob it goes pow i mean <laughs> it's comic book like but it is also a survival game that is permadeath. And that's just something that you don't see in games. 
So it's comedy, but it's like it's you have to work at it. I mean, you you can't just stand around and not do anything. You're always having to deal with hunger. You're having to get resources for building uh, supplies. Have we even got coal yet? We haven't even got coal yet, which is oh my god, a new uh, stone prop, um, not prop property, but uh, iron ore. Okay. Let's put that down here with the ores and uh, just keep getting more sun. I think we're going to need to find a place though. We're going to have to find a place to make our home sometime soon. And I kind of like this grassy area, but oh, what's that? We got a new thing. That's coal. Okay, I think we needed coal to make that smelter. We need three coal, so we only need one more. We have the 20 stone that's required. Uh, you know what? I'm going to put this there, put that there, and then put the coal at the end. All right. Let's keep going. I I want to get all the stuff. So we can make both. Well, we can make one bench now. Uh, actually, we can make two of them. We can make the campfire, and we can also make uh, the workbench. So maybe that's just a good enough start. We can use those to be able to get into... Uh, Oh, and I think we just got a coal. I heard a noise. I don't like the noises. Some noises are bad noises. We got three coal now. Let's travel away from the noise and see if we can't find a place to set down and, uh, and make a home out of. Also, I kind of probably want to stay along this water. That way, if I move to any place, I can follow the water always back to my house. That might be the best thing for us. And I'm not seeing anything. Oh my goodness, that guy just scared the heck out of me. Uh, he, he spit something at me. You spitter. You don't spit at people. That's not good. That's not nice. <laughs> right. Um, I see another big stone over here. And... Oh, what's that? There's something right there. Looks like a... Um, an Easter Island head kind of thing. Let's go check that out. Hopefully that doesn't want to kill me because that would be bad. Um, let's see. Is that... Oh, and we... No! No! Ooh, that was so close. That was so close. Nope! 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 I'm not going to mess with him. I I really want the stone, but I... Oh, and there we go. Yep, we're out of here. We're out. Okay, let's, well, let's try to fight him. Oh, if you miss, we move. If, if you miss, oh, oh. That's interesting. They don't like sunlight. <laughs> so, we just need to dodge them until daylight, it would seem. Hello, good sir. How may I? Oh, hello. Hey, he has a gold eye and a copper eye. I don't have gold. Let's farm for gold. I wonder what happens if you put the right ores on there. I, this, I mean, that's what I'm guessing you would have to do. You would put ores on there because uh, they're based off of the colors of his eyes. Is that gold? That looks like gold. That looks like what gold would look like. That was gold. Okay, let's let's do this get on his little platform here and we're gonna put uh wait a minute do we have to do it by which i i'm gonna say that we do it from left to right or maybe it doesn't even matter but okay oh that that did the thing so that we were right on that let's do this oh my goodness we get to keep the stones that we put on the ground and he is giving us or we got or oh my goodness we need oh, what is that the statue of liberty kind of thing the uh the planet of the apes kind of i can't believe they did it <laughs> that is so freaking awesome we gotta go check that out maybe we can make that our home i mean look at how big that thing is you can't miss that all right so we have five we now have I'm hearing noises again. I don't like the noises. 
Why you gotta make noises? A, a rainbow. I wonder if you have to get to the end of the rainbow for you to be able to get, like, rewards or something. Um... Maybe later? I mean, I don't know how we would get over there before the rainbow goes away. What in the world are you, sir? You Oh, that's one of those things where you dip him in the water and he, uh, and he, um, and he dips down and then because of the water that's based at the bottom here he would um he would then be flipped back up and then he would go down again and flip back up let's do oh you don't have any coins we got to find a coin if if that place over there is habitable we are definitely going to have to stay around this area i want to put a coin in him and see what he does and oh hello hi guy you're not nice. And it's nighttime already again. What in the world is going on? Okay. I'm going to just stay, keep moving around this guy. And we got some more ore, it looks like. We need to get all this stuff. Was that coal? We got more coal. That's good. And we got this stone guy. We, at least we know how to take care of him. Just turn around them and then... Nice. I'm fine taking on mobs by themselves. Uh, by the way, we're, our food situation is really getting low, and I'm not liking that at all. Wow, that took a lot to kill him. I'm not fighting you, slime. You're meanie. You're a mean guy. I don't want to fight slimes. Look at look at that guy. He looks amazing. Is that a frog? Is that a frog guy? Oh my goodness. This is awesome. Oh man. Yeah, we gotta go check out what he what he has going on. And another slime. It's, what, 11 p.m. The slimes don't go away until morning. So we're gonna have to try to just stay away from them. We got a box here. Let's open this thing. Uh, hopefully it has food. It looks like oh we got a we got a tool it looks like we got a carrot we got a carrot let's eat the carrot okay what was that oh there's a potatoid that's what you can make uh, you need two potatoids to make uh, to make the uh, the the French fry looking things potato 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 <laughs> I'm getting my words mixed up potatoid fries I think is what it's actually called what is it called potato fries yeah yeah that's what they're called hurry right, what are you about what's going on with you sir what is that is that a frog oh no no whoa whoa hey buddy don't you Okay then. <laughs> um, what is that? Okay, let's break this down. What are you, little fella? Uh oh. Oh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, I hit him. <laughs> As you saw, these guys don't go away. Oh, okay. You know what? Are those... <laughs> are they holding fly slaughters? Is that what's going on here? Ooh. Okay. Okay. Okay, nice dodge. Nice dodge. I got the dodge thing on point. Let's try to get this guy. Let's get one of them down. Playing roulette here. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay, nice. We hit him again. Hello. <laughs> the sound of these guys is so awesome. Okay. I don't want to hit that cacti. Oh, okay. We hit him again. 
Oh, move. Move whenever you don't hit him on that first try. If you don't hit him, that means something's wrong and something's about to happen. So you definitely want to get out of the way. Oh, what are these? Okay, we gotta, we gotta, um, we gotta eat that. I'm sorry. What in the world is this? That's blobfish. That's the stuff that you, uh, to make the, uh, the, uh, the uh, fishy fingers. I think is what they're called. Hey, we gotta finish this guy out. I mean, they, they seem to drop something, uh, some interesting stuff. And he has a, he has a fly swatter. I mean, come on. Just, the little things like this. Like this guy and the fact that he has a shrine. Oh! Woo! Nice save time there. That's a thing. That's a thing that they could change. It's not, uh, give us the option to not autosave. Because if we die because autosave, then, you know, that's not going to end up helping us because we're going to lose our save when we die. <laughs> By the way, we still have yet to take any damage during this, uh, during this game. So that's kind of cool. Yeah, I think I'm going to use this for my house. Uh, let's chop this straight, and then we're going to check out what this guy is. It's a little boxy box guy. Oh my goodness. And he has a little, little bubble eye looking things too. That's so awesome. Alright, let's get all this. Uh, I think it's time to start making stuff. Open the box. Cardboard mask. Boxify your head because boxes are cool. Let's do it. <gasps> he loves us because we. Oh my god, this is so awesome. Let's let's come out here real quick. Oh, he's farting. He does <laughs> he does little farts. He farts. Let's let's get close in on this. Oh my goodness, look at that! <laughs> and he holds things too, so... Okay, we gotta get the storage situation going, but we gotta be careful because it is now nighttime, And we do not want to take damage. We've, we've gone so far with no damage done. So... <laughs> that is so awesome. Okay, um, workbench. Let's make the workbench now. I think I just heard a noise of, of a mob. Okay, we need to hurry up. Make this thing. Make it... Oh, I'm hearing noises all around me. Okay, let's put that down. Let's take a look around outside. Yeah, there's a blob over there. Okay, Boxy Box. I want you to be careful over here. Let's put you in here. And I, I'm going to put my Boxy Head on uh, back in you so that you don't get hurt, okay? And, oh, he made a little sad noise. I'm going to put that in there, and that in there, and, um, that in there. Okay, we need to make food real quick. Uh, we have the, that, uh, uh fish stick things. Okay, we got to, we got to worry. We got to worry about getting hit here now. Okay, we got, we got, uh, where are they? Uh, that's not it. Right there. We ate, okay, let's make another, uh, we don't have mushrooms to make that. Uh, we don't have another blobby fish. Oh, the campfire's out. Okay. Just keeping track of what's going on around us. Okay. One more. I don't want to cook everything. I, I want to save, save things. That way, in case we need more uh, later or... Maybe food is used to make better, or meat is to, used to make better food later than we want to do that. So we are supposed to be able to make new things now. Let's take a look at what those might be. Um, let's actually start at the top. So tools. Takes tin wood for the wooden tools. Ooh, fishing. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I really have um, specific requirements whenever it comes to fishing in games. I want them to have really cool games to the fishing game. Or that you don't just stand there and it automatically gives you a fish every few seconds or anything like that. Stone tools, that's something we can actually start working on because that is going to give us the ability to make... I mean, those are cheap. 
We still have 20 wood and we have 40. Let's do that. And we got we got a stone um we got a stone shovel already. Let's do this. That's going to leave us uh okay, we're not going to make any more of that. Let's see what else we can make in here. Uh we need to make this. Sorry, Boxy Box. I'll put the mask on in a moment. Just trying to get some stuff done. Okay. Let, oh, this thing is big. Um, so, to confirm attack, interact is... Uh, okay, that's the right click. Uh, comma and period. So, to turn it. Let's put that down. And let's see. Okay, we have a new tab. So, for copper... It takes five copper. We have seven. Plus we already have a copper bar. And um, one coal. We got five coal. Look at all that. Um, let's look let's look at here. So a cooking pot takes five wood and one copper. Let's make that real quick. Is that something I'm going to have to put over top of that, or does it do it automatically? What's going to happen here? Okay, cool. It automatically just does that. Uh, food. I'm guessing that's going to give us better... F oh my goodness. Full apple cake. Uh, pie. I mean, that is so easy to get. I mean, all we have to do is chop down every tree around us. Carrot cake. I'm guessing we're going to have to plant seeds to be able to get that. Vegetable smoothie, three broccoli, uh, broccoli, broccoli, uh, one ice and a cooking pot, um, meat steak, two meat, two ice. Okay, so this is a thing. Uh, we're gonna be able to make good stuff. This right here, that's ten health per. Um, so I'm guessing that whenever it says ten, that means ten percent, since we don't actually have a health bar. That gives us a total amount of health that we have. So that is going to be really cool. Um, anything else? Tools? Nothing different there. Oh yeah, we, we need to check uh, what else uh, do we have. An anvil. We need we need iron. We need, <laughs> we need iron. Okay. Um, a chest. Uh, yes, please. We can do that, actually. We just need to fire this up. And we're going to make a copper bar. But we're going to have to get some wood. And we need to put these down here. Uh, how much wood did this say we need to get? 20 wood. You know what? I don't think that's going to be a problem. One. Okay. Yeah. Oh my goodness. This is so much faster. That's... Oh my goodness. Okay. Bad. Bad guy. Okay, we gotta move. Whenever we get into a bind, we have to move. Because I feel that's... And then I'm not gonna do more than a few hits before we move. Oh, wow. That took that guy out fast. Okay, you, sir. You, no. No. Uh-uh. We gotta stop concentrating on trying to pick up these things and move. Oh, oh. Get away. Get away. Okay, move. Okay, hit him again. Got him. Okay, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Ooh, what's this? Let's get it all. Inventory full. Okay, we gotta... Okay, what's... Come on, Boxy Box. Ooh. Um, well, let's put this on. Uh, that means Boxy Box is gonna follow us, though. Mysterious Goop. That has 10 health on it, but it's gonna take 30 hunger away. That really isn't that bad, though. So let's put that in there. What else... Oh, this is, it's over here. It's over here. Um, s sand, I'm guessing. And there's a little castle-looking thing. Okay, that's cool. Let's get the wood. And get the seed. And uh, let's get this wood here. Alright, we... How much wood do we have now? Okay, I think what we're going to do is get this chest made. And then we're going to end the video there. Because we have done really well. We have taken no damage. And I don't know why I keep iterating that. But we have taken no damage during this whole thing. And that is pretty darn cool. 
Oh, we got another blob. Stay, stay clear, Mr. Mr. Boxy Box. We don't want you to get hurt. Oh, yep, yep. One, two, move. One, two, slap, slap, move. Okay. You can drive. Take him out. He should be almost dead. And we gotta move. We gotta move away. Okay. I understand you. Oh! Definitely move. <sighs> These guys. Okay. We, we gotta move again. Okay. Okay. This is actually working. Just doing the juking and jiving. Please don't kill me. Okay. Oh. And I just heard another one spawn. Oh my goodness. We, oh, inventory's full. Uh, what can we get rid of? Uh, I don't want to get rid of that. Let's put this down for a second. Let's pick up this. And let's open Mr. Boxy Box. He has... What did we pick up? We picked up the... the <laughs> we picked up the fish. Okay, let's pick up this. And now Mr. Boxy Box. Okay, there we go. And now we'll pick up the fish just because we want the fish. Okay, where are we at? Where, where did the other guy die? He died over here. Another mysterious goop thing. Okay, so I, I guess we'll put down the seeds. Pick up the goop. Let's open this guy up and put the goop in him. Alright. And how are we doing on wood now? We still need wood. <laughs> we, we we never got to chop down these trees because of the fact that those little goopy goops ended up getting in our way and that's not nice of them I mean that's not nice at all so let's get these these are really nice tall trees so all of this should be more than enough and we have some food that we can eat there and we need to eat it so let's put this down for a second and let's get on the side of oh you know what we don't want to eat it we don't want to eat the full apple we want to keep it so we can make full apple pie. Oh my goodness. Uh, yay, yay, yay. We got 20 wood. Uh, we need to remember that these seeds are there. Because we're going we're gonna to plant those next time. But let's go ahead and come back over here. And make a chest. So, chest. I really love this this cardboard box. Uh, not only Mr. Boxy Box, but the cardboard box head thing is so amazing. Alright, let's put that right there. Let's open it up, and we're going to put our falafels in there. We're going to put our uh, stuff, that, that, that. Oh my goodness, all of it. Um, meat we're going to need soon, but... Uh, and we need to plant this stuff. Uh, let me go get my seeds real quick. And we're going to get the stuff out of Mr. Boxy Box. And we may take him around with us whenever we, uh, whenever we go out harvesting and stuff. That way we have the ability to throw stuff in Mr. Boxy Box. And we need to start collecting plants now that we know that there is a... Oh, there's a, there's a little container over here. We need this... Oh, and we just got a free axe. Now, I, that... Makes me wonder, do, uh, do axes degrade? So, we may want to just throw that in our chest as well. But Mr. Boxy Box, he's having fun over here with me. Is it a right turning night again? Oh, jeez. That's crazy. Alright, let's, um, let's throw that in there. Uh, we should probably keep these ores on us, just because of the fact you never know. And throw that axe in there, because we already have one. Throw the seeds in there. What do you got, Mr. Boxy Box? Um, let's open you up. Oh, I didn't mean to kick you. All right, we're going to take all of this. we got to keep that shovel on us. And put all of this in here. And the slime. And, uh, well, we're going to carry wood on us because that's kind of the thing that we're, we do. All right. Anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. This has been a really fun time. And I feel that while we didn't die this time, 
there is a chance that we can die at any time. So thank you so much for watching. This has been Cypher Deck. Peace out. Out.